Hey guys, welcome back to Brianna's Palace. My name is Brianna if you're new here and on this channel I post videos related to all things Disney and Loungefly. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell button so you don't miss when I post and let's get right into the video. So I'm super excited for today's video because I will be doing a decorate with me for Valentine's Day Disney edition of course. So a few days ago I actually went to Marshalls to pick up a few things for Valentine's Day and some decor items to decorate my lounge fly shelves with so I will insert that video right now. So after shopping, I did find a couple things that I thought would be perfect for my Valentine's Day lounge fly display. And I will show you guys the whole process of me redecorating my shelves and all of the things that I bought. So just stay tuned. And I also wanted to mention that I'm wearing this Valentine's Day inspired crew neck that I got from Etsy. I will leave it in the description below but it's so cute and super soft and I thought it would be so perfect for this Valentine's video. So it's just Minnie giving Mickey a little kiss and it has little hearts on the top and I thought that was just so cute and so perfect for Valentine's Day. And I also tried to do a little pink Valentine's Day inspired makeup for today. I actually used this palette from Kylie Cosmetics. It's Kylie's Valentine's Day collection and I thought the colors were just perfect for this look. I'll give you guys a little close up look just in case you were wondering. I'm wearing this palette and I'm wearing all of these colors. All the pink colors. So if you were wondering I think this palette is honestly perfect for a cute valentine's day makeup look so it's definitely a must i'm so excited to show you guys everything that i got from marshall's so let's just jump right in okay guys i actually put this pillow up as well on my bed i got this a few years ago from target and it's a cute fuzzy red heart-shaped pillow that says be mine and lately i've just been wearing this Disney Valentine's Day lounge fly and I think the colors are just perfect and it's just so cute and this will definitely go on my shelf. I'm just trying to see how I would arrange it with my other lounge flies so that it would make the most sense. And right over here I just purchased this new Valentine's lounge fly that is actually a Disney Park exclusive. I ordered this on Shop Disney uh, like a week ago and I just think the colors are so cute. You guys already know I love Stitch and especially with Angel on it I just had to get it with all the hearts. And it's a park exclusive so I just love this bag honestly and I think it's perfect and it would look really nice on my display. Also on Shop Disney I decided to pick up these beautiful ears they are so pretty let me focus it real quick so you can see all the details it just has this really gorgeous embroidery of flowers bows and it has this beautiful pearl trim on the ears i also found these super cute heart print pajamas that were super soft the quality is so good and there were only $20 for the set and I got me and my sister matching ones so that we can wear them for a little Valentine's party. So 
there's these i will be wearing them tonight because we are doing a little valentine's slash galentine's get together thing so i just thought these were the cutest i also got a couple more things i decided to pick up these fake tulips that come with this really simple nice sleek vase and i thought this would look so cute with the rest of my valentine stuff but also to use during the spring so a lot of the stuff that i got can be used for the springtime as well so i just love that i got this super adorable be mine heart that kind of looks like those candy hearts and it's so cute and this would look perfect on my display as a nice decor piece for Valentine's Day. Next up, I went ahead and got this adorable Valentine's bowl with Mickey and Minnie on it with hearts everywhere. And it's red on the outside with little white hearts. And then this next thing I actually got a while ago from Marshalls, but I just kept it for this video. And it is this... Actually, I think it's like to bake stuff in. It's heart shaped because it says that it's oven and microwave safe. So yeah, you could bake little treats in this, but I'm honestly going to use this for like, I don't know, maybe a decor piece. Maybe I'll just use it for like desserts or something. But anyway, I got this because I just thought it was cute and it's pink, so... Of course I had to get it. So next I just have a few more things that I saved that I bought from Shop Disney. I got this from Shop Disney as well. Um, they were selling these plushies for a discounted price with any purchase. So this was, a, I believe, uh, originally $30. And if you purchased something with it, it, was, it came down to $16. So obviously I had to get this because I just thought it was so adorable. The colors are perfect for the display that I'm going for. And I just think Minnie looks absolutely adorable with her little rose in her bow. And all of the pink on her outfit, the little ruffles. Everything just looks so cute. And then I recently just got this new new emos of Angel. And, of course, she's pink, so I think she would look so cute on display as well. And we'll see how this looks. Oh, I'm actually going to pair this with the new Stitch and Angel Valentine's bag. So I think this is going to go next to that because that would look so perfect. Next up, I got this love sign also from Marshalls. I just thought this was so cute and simple for my display. I love the colors and I would honestly use this past Valentine's Day because the aesthetic is just so me. So, love that. And then lastly from Marshalls, I got this Valentine's Day garland with this beautiful sparkly rose gold color. And this would look perfect either hanging up over my bed or... I could do something with it over my lounge fly display. So this is how my display looks right now. Got a lot of pinks going on, but it's definitely not screaming Valentine's Day. So we're going to change this up a bit so that it can look a little bit more for the occasion. And I will show you guys the whole process. Okay, so this is what my shelves look like currently. So I think I'm going to start off by taking off my little Toy Story alien because that definitely doesn't match the Valentine's vibe we're going for. So I just had my little alien sipper and my little alien plush and my little reversible octopus plush. They're coming down because they don't fit the Valentine's vibe. But I know I'm going to just first start taking down my Funkos because I just don't feel like they really match. I was thinking maybe for this shelf I could do like a mini. Maybe we'll put the little Be Mine sign like right here. 
I'm not sure where this would look the best. Either on the top. Is this too much if it's like in the middle? I could either put the love sign up here or I could put it down here. But let's figure out where we're gonna put this bag because the bags are what takes up the most space. Okay, so I have all my pink girly ears and I'm gonna see how I like it if they were just like right here. So I think I'm going to take this away. So I kind of want to replace it with either one of these bags. And then I want to take away this cup. Okay, this is the first option. To have my Piglet Pink Lounge Fly with my Stitching Angel. And then have the Angel Nuimos in the middle. And then I could probably even put these tulips in the back even more decor I think that looks really cute so now we'll move on to the bottom shelf because it definitely needs some work I think I want to bring in my wedding lounge fly because it just fits the theme of course with love and Valentine's Day and it's neutral so it can go with any lounge fly that I put with it and then I could end up putting this one next to it. And then I'll just put the wallet with the wedding one to give a nice contrast. And then I could put this little bowl with it. I could tilt it this way. A little Mickey and Minnie shelf, like wedding themed, love themed. And I think that's cute. Okay guys, so I think I figured out how I like it best. So I just put mini right here on the left. I put the be mine sign in the middle and I threw in a few pink curly ears on the right. I think this looks really good. And then down, I just kept pretty much everything the same except that I put this love sign in the middle and then I just pushed the perfume to the back and I think it gives a really cute contrast and then beneath I just have my stitch and angels shelf and I just think that looks so cute with little tulips in the background and then lastly I just have my Mickey and Minnie slash wedding shelf I think this turned out really cute Okay guys, I love how it's turned out. The shelves look so cute now. But I almost forgot that I also have this heart garland to put up. So I think it might be too big to put like hanging off of the shelves. So I'm not sure where I should put this. So it's definitely too long for the shelves, so I think I'm just going to have to hang it under my bed. Although it would be so cute if it was like hanging like on top of each shelf, but it's definitely not going to work. So I think this is just how I'm going to leave my shelves for right now. I think they really turned out super cute and super pink and valentine's theme so i hope you enjoyed watching i'm gonna insert a little montage right here show you guys all 
of the Valentine's party stuff and decor that I put together with my sister for our little Valentine's party. So I'll show you guys that right now. So that is it for today's video you guys i'm so happy with how my shelves turned out i think they look so nice for valentine's day and i really hope you enjoyed watching if you did make sure to give this video a thumbs up subscribe and hit that bell button and comment down below any more video ideas you would like to see from me and i'd be happy to do that for you thank you guys once again for watching and i will see you guys in my next video